Hey guys, welcome back to Underground Diecast. This is your friend Harshad, and this is the part two of Cool Collectible series. Uh, this is a '50s Coke machine, Coke vending machine. Uh, in the '50s, this machine was made by a company called Vendo. Okay, but this miniature scale model has been made by a company called Enesco, and uh, this particular machine was. in the 1950s okay and it used to hold roughly let me show you how many bottles i'll show that i'll show how many bottles it holds later but here you can see all the bottles lined up and so on and so forth so in this video what i'm going to cover is um, different uh, features of this particular machine and uh, some musical aspects of this machine how it's operated so on and so forth uh, there are a few videos on youtube which uh, demonstrate this machine but i'll try to go in greater detail uh, as far as this machine is concerned so this is a scaled model first of all let me clarify that it is in my estimation uh, based on the research i i have done so far it appears to be 1/8 scale Uh, to the actual size of the machines in that era uh, and i did the calculation it appears that th this is a 1/8 scale the construction completely is all uh, metal uh, only this part is uh, plastic uh, this is the compartment for the battery to be inserted so it is a battery operated uh, machine and the purpose of this machine as a miniature model is actually a coin bank can you imagine do you see any place where you can deposit coin so this is the place where you deposit the coin from the top so <laughs> it's a very cool feature i will definitely show you how it works and how much access you have to the coins so it is just a name sake or you know just for the sake of calling it a coin bank you can't store like huge number of coins but it's just a symbolic coin bank it's just a cool collectible piece i plan to keep it in my diorama i have in the past uh, kept it in my garage diorama i converted the garage into a showroom so maybe most likely in some corner it will sit nicely as a prop but it's not 118 scale my garage is 118 but still it is so cool that i wanted to have it it's a very nice collectible from my collection so let me quickly show you Uh, how this coin bank actually works so you take this coin and you just insert it here and if you heard there's a music effect as soon as you insert the coin let me put one more coin so that music instrument uh, i mean this uh, music effect does work this machine was actually built in the year 1994 So it's almost thirty years old. So we are in twenty twenty three. So imagine the nineties machines working in twenty twenty three, and still working. That's really a great feeling, right? I'm a nineties kid myself. So I'm not. I was not born in nineties, but I really relish the nineties era. So one more feature. As soon as you open, it does open. so you heard the lady sing it's the real thing and here you can see the number of bottles in it and you know uh, if you want to really uh, calculate the number of bottle total <laughs> just pause the video and count yourself i don't want to you know do that at this moment but yeah this is really cool and the coins which we inserted from the front they are all you know accumulated here so as you can see the the space to collect coins is not huge so i would say it's just a symbolic coin machine maybe you can store some really really rare coins which are um, you know smaller in number here but i don't know it's a coin bank and it works well uh, but it's not a full fledged coin bank it has lots of details you know there is a compressor at the bottom it's fully metallic most of the pieces are metallic but some of the pieces are plastic 
but overall the construction is extremely good uh, i mean it almost resembles to the actual thing and so on and so forth there is one more button at the back over here okay so let me show you what it does so i will press the button and it will you know i think it just moves the complete row of things on the right or left and then you can take this bottle and insert or refill the bottle and that way you can refill all your bottles once they are out so i believe this is a very very nice cool feature of that and let me close done all right so let's take a quick 360 again for the final time overall so this is the speaker this is that button and this is the battery compartment overall for a product which was almost 30 years old still working condition i'm extremely happy to have it in my collection and uh, let me know what you think about this collectible and uh, i hope you really enjoyed this really video this concludes our we are at the conclusion phase of this video so please like share subscribe to my channel please press the bell icon it really helps and motivates me to continue recording these kind of videos please let me know what you think thank you